Hi guys, it's Sheila. Welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk about a camera bag that I pre-ordered last year around August and it's finally here. It has taken a long time to get to me, but I'm super excited. Um, I first heard about this brand when the original bag came out. It's called Wondered. And a lot of photographers would post it on YouTube, Instagram, saying that this was one of the best investments that they had made for um, their photography career and business. Was really looking into it, but the price tag was very big, so I definitely had to take my time and uh, save up for it. Then they came out with a new version. Some of the things that people were complaining about had been updated and they had added some things here and there like uh, pockets inside and stuff that I'm gonna show you in a second. So I went ahead and purchased this one. This one is called the all new Provoke pack. So the whole, the bag is called Provoke and this is the all new one. They also have the original and you can get different inserts um, depending on what your needs are. You can get the bag itself, which is just a backpack. Doesn't have like this shape to it because this is coming from the inside um, photo bundle. And you can get a smaller photo bundle that would be like half of it. If you were to put like one camera body one uh, lens and maybe like a small drone. And then you can get the pro bundle, which goes all the way up. And I'm gonna show you that in a second. I'm gonna open it up. But basically I wanna show you uh, what the bag looks like. It's very sturdy. It feels really nice. It comes in this beautiful waterproof material and it's very, you can tell that it's gonna like, you know, be able to be in very <laughs> hard situations and do well over time. Um, and it has, so many pockets i cannot even tell you and then it also has this on the top which folds and you are able to open it up uh, it has this little clip right here Ooh. it's really hard if i'm like doing it from this angle but basically you unclip it and this little baggie opens up on the top and you're able to put like either a raincoat clothes or anything additional to your camera um, equipment so there it is so you basically shove it in there and then bundle it up again which makes the back super waterproof um having this in this area and i love the fact that it has this hook right here i think it's really nice and then you can like tighten it with this right here the handles on the top are magnetic which is really nice so it's easy to just grab your bag and one of them says wonder more and the other one says worry less which i think is really nice because when you're grabbing your bag it's kind of like a little nice message to remind you to enjoy life to the fullest and do the things that you love to do so i think it's just a little um like a very nice touch that they gave it on the back of it there's a pocket right here i'm not sure what the purpose of this one is you can put like your sunglasses or anything you think you might need during the day for easy access. Okay, so there's so many pockets, I don't even know where to start, but basically I'm gonna start on the front. I already showed you the one on the top. Then it also has this pocket right here, which you can put maybe a notebook or any anything that you need um, during the day. The one thing that I will mention is that I'm probably not gonna put anything that has some kind of shape to it on the front because the bag opens up from the back. Um, so I, I'm gonna be laying it, um, this is the part that's gonna go on the ground. So I'm not gonna put anything, you know, important or anything like that here and i also don't want the bag to lose its shape moving on to the side it has this really nice pocket here where you can put a water bottle or if you need more space to put a tripod you can open it up and it has its little slit right there and you can clip it here so that's super nice i love it i love the fact that you know it folds into a very small pocket you can open it up if you need more space um, I think that's everything on this side. We're gonna move on to the other side. On the other side, it has this pocket right here where you can put like your wallet or keys. And then it also ha has a clip for uh, your keys if you like have your car keys in there. It also has a clip in case you need to put something else here that you wanna tie. But the coolest thing about it, about this bag is that it has this side pocket. And from here, you can grab your camera. Um, I do have it close, like the bundle the pro bundle i have it closed just because i'm afraid that if i don't have this like sturdy wall right here maybe my camera will suffer a little bit now that i don't think that this bag is covering it enough i just i don't know i don't know if i'm going to be using this so i feel like when i'm using it i can just open up the bundle fold it back and have this if i need it but the really cool thing about this lot is that it has a little pocket here which you can open uh right there and then if you open this little zipper, it has three slots to put 
your um, memory cards, which I think is amazing. I can't even believe that they thought about all these little details. And all the way on the bottom, this is gonna be hard to show, but it also has a pocket. I think here you can put some kind of waterproof um, cover for your bag or you know anything else, but that's cool that they have that. So there's one more thing that I did forget to mention. It has really nice cushions on the back. I think this is very comfortable when you're holding it. The bag is definitely heavy with all the things that I have in it, but this is like a full day of a wedding that I have my equipment in here for. And it has this lot which you can put, if you're putting like your bag on a carry-on, you can put these through the hooks of the carry-on and just have it really nice and sturdy. And then right underneath that, which you can't see, which is great, there's a slot where you can put like your passport if you're traveling or just anything important that you don't want people to see because you can barely see the zipper. So I think that's really nice that they gave you like that slot um, for just more privacy and you know people won't know that you have something in there. So the back comes with two different uh, things that you can kind of customize if you want them on or not. So this one is for your for your waist. I did try to put it on just because I'm on the smaller side. I don't have like a lot of upper strength. So I definitely want to, you know, use the waist to carry most of the weight um, instead of my back. So I do have it on. The one thing I don't like is that it's not attachable into each other. So it just makes it very bulky on the back with all the things on. But honestly, once you start using it, it's kind of like not even there. And then this is the actual backside of the bag that I'm going to open up for you guys and we can take a look at all the things that I have in here. So it's super big, as you can see. I have one camera body, one 50 millimeter lens. I have another lens right here, um, another lens, and then here goes my Fuji, which I'm filming with, with it, its lens, which is very small. I also have my Mavic Air 2. Um, the remote is right here on the top, and it still has room to, I still have room to like put other things on, up there. I have the two drone batteries, my flash and the mag mod and my also my flash for my camera so i have a lot of things in here i definitely can customize this as i need it if i need to take the drone out and put another lens so there's plenty of room to move stuff around all of this is detachable you can move it and this what you're looking at here is the pro um photography pro bundle which comes all the way to the top you kind of slide it in and fold the, um, the slits back so you can open it up. You can choose to have it closed, but that would be like opening a bag to open a bag. If you're traveling and you wanna be super careful, you can always like put the slits back, close them up, put them under uh, either in your carry-on uh, seat or over the top, and I think it would be very like nice and safe. So I don't know if you can see, but it also has these um, clips right here. These are for another of the customizable uh, attachments that they bring and you can kind of clip those in and create like a little table if that makes any sense so if you are shooting outside and you are by yourself you can always like hook oh, i'm doing it wrong <laughs> you can use this as a backpack like this and the bag is going to stand for you I don't know if you can see, but it's easy to grab things. I can always like make these smaller if I don't want my bag falling as much as it is right now. I just really haven't used it. And then when I'm not using it, I just unclip it. This bag is like much bigger than me as you can see, but I can just unclip it and bring these in, which is super cool. So, that's super nice. That is the biggest like thing with this camera. I feel like it fits so much more than my previous uh, camera bags, but obviously I hadn't really invested in an expensive one. I was using one from Amazon, which was pretty big and actually did really well. And it was very sturdy. So I'm definitely gonna keep it around just for other things, but it's nowhere near like the cost of this one. Um, I don't know if this one is like available to order already or if it's still on pre-order because they are still sending out the people that ordered like last year. This side right here has the most pockets, I would say. It has a big slot for a um, computer and even fits a Mac 16 inch, if that's what you have. And it has a smaller pocket that goes all the way to the bottom as well, if you have like an iPad or anything like that. Um, on these two pockets, I put like, um, I forget what I put in here. Oh, I put like my drone accessories, like the filters. And then on this one, I have just a, cloth to clean my lenses 
And on here I have all my batteries. So they definitely gave us enough pockets to like put all of our stuff. This, this one on here doesn't really have a pocket. I think it's just this like cushion for your camera equipment to be safe. So I also forgot to mention that here you can kind of attach things if you need to. And then on the uh, waist strap, you also have a little pocket where you can put like maybe like a chapstick or just anything that you need on the go. I'm super excited. I can't wait to like see the things that I can do with this bag. I can always take the photo bundle out and use it as a hiking pack if I want to. Um, or I can just put, you know, half of my gear in there and then use the rest for clothing. And um, they also sell some accessories on the site that I can, you know, buy separately and customize this bag as I want it. But overall, it just feels really nice. It feels like I, you know, um, got my money's worth with the quality and the uh, material that it is. It feels very resistant. Um, I haven't really tested the waterproofness of it, but I definitely want to do that. And in, I live in a very cold area where it snows a lot. So that's my number one thing. It has to be waterproof and my gear has to be protected. So I'm super happy with the choice that I made. I looked into other brands that offered like similar bags. This one is a 31 liter um, bag there's a 21 and I think there's a 41 I'm not sure if that's like on the site or you have to like contact them directly But this one was a very good size for me and with the pro bundle I feel like I made the right choice So if you have any questions, please leave them down below try to go as fast as I could through all the um, compartments and all the you know accessories and uh, good things about this bag, but I am super happy with it. It comes in three colors I chose the green one. I think it comes in a blue black and green I think that's right, but uh, I love the color. I think it's so nice and yeah, I'm super happy with it. So thank you so, so much for watching this video. Let me know below if you have any questions or if you're looking to buy this bag. I'm also gonna link the original one below so you can uh, check the differences. I think the main thing is that um, the other one doesn't have like the pockets on the computer uh, slot. And I think those are very important to me because I carry a lot of uh, batteries at one time. And it's just a nice way to like carry little extra stuff that you always have around like cables, charging cables, whatever. So as always, don't forget to leave a comment down below and subscribe and I will see you guys on my next one. Bye.